I, it is a bit sad when an industry that is worth billions inside a nation and also billions globally is reduced to nothing. There is no music market in Zimbabwe because of piracy. But if musicians are put on a particular platform and they begin to give value to their work, they begin to export their work, they can generate, that is, they can make some money for themselves. I'm saying all musicians from Zimbabwe, you might have an audio, a video, or even your online store, I invite you to come and post your links on this platform for free. What this platform does is this. It helps to realize the potential of musicians and their sales. Don't forget to also mention your phone number, your email number, just in case someone somewhere abroad wants to work with you. And so you can just trace there the links to your audio, your videos, or if you have an online store, you say, this is my sample. You place the link there, and then you also place the link to your store. So someone listens, and then they buy your song if they like it. As for the corporates, you can take part in one or two ways. Number one, you can advertise once a year on the section called Zimbabwe Business, or you can become a patron, which is a sponsor. For those details, you can email me at, that is my email address is appszimbabwe at gmail.com. For the site address, whether you are a musician or you just want to see, you go to http zimbabwe arts dot x o b o r dot com or just click on the link below for the full details of this website and what it's all about. That is there you also see my phone number. So corporates endorse yourselves with art because music is uh, exciting. To endorse yourself is to be associated with the musicians so that when they are being rotated, people will also see your brands or your products. Bye for now.